very good morning to you all and a very happy feast day. Today we celebrate the feast of Pentecost, the birthday of the church, and we recall how in the scriptures we're told the disciples, along with our Blessed Lady, were locked away in the upper room, behind closed doors and shutters. The gift of the Holy Spirit descended upon them and they were empowered they were enabled then to go out and preach and teach the gospel of Christ to the ends of the earth. Filled with that same Holy Spirit, they were committed, they were faithful to the mission entrusted to them by our blessed Lord. We too pray now for an outpouring of that same Holy Spirit, so that very soon our locked doors will be flung open and the people of God may come and gather and build up his body, the church, so that strengthened by him, nourished and sustained by him in and through the most blessed sacrament, we too may give witness to the faith which we profess. May this Holy Spirit, even in lockdown, reaffirm, rekindle the mission entrusted to each one of us to spread the good news that God loves each and every one of us. The Feast of Pentecost concludes our Easter celebration, but the story doesn't end there. We now need to pick up the pieces and once again put into practice the faith of our fathers. May this blessing be a reminder that God continues to love us, support us and encourage us until we are once again able to meet around the altar of God as a parish family. And may Almighty God bless you and your loved ones in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. As this feast concludes our Easter celebration, we therefore fittingly end where we began. Alleluia! Alleluia! Alleluia.